Alright, hello folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. Um, yeah, last time we had to get all those weird potions and stuff and and try to turn Sid back into a human, but instead we turned him into Kermit. Anyhow, so we figured out we gotta go to Black Mage Village, but that's not gonna happen for some time now. Because today is side quest time! Off screen, I actually went back. Oh, let me sail back here so you know where I'm going. Um, off screen, I sold all of my potions and I and I reduced my quantities on my other stuff to 50. I don't know if you need to do that or not, but you're gonna be getting lots of items because today we're gonna go chocograph hunting. Now, See this huge island right here? That's going to be our destination, but we can't get in there. So, the very island right next to it, right over here is where you have to go. So you can get up on a chocobo. Get some Gishal Green. See that? I got rid of all my potions. There's a reason for that. One of our prizes, oh, um, before I explain that. And we could go on just a short trip to this island. This will be very nice. Be a short, easy walk. But the game doesn't let us connect. No! So you know what the, we have to do, folks? We have to go all the way around. So from your ship, you're gonna make a left instead of a right. And you have to go all the way through this gigantic archipelago. And let me tell you, that's no fun. All the way through here. So you can go. Oh. Oh, here we go. Just so we get over here. Our ship is just on that island there, but we had to go all the way around. So lovely. Here we go. The Chocobo's Lagoon. Who's that Chocobo? Kubo! Where's Choco? Not sure what happened, but he is definitely Choco. Yeah, I remember uh, he did that of evolution so that he could go in uh, streams and stuff. But why? Well, I guess the legend is true, Kubo! I'll tell you a secret. I'm looking for paradise on Earth. So is everybody else, folks. Only chosen Chocobos can evolve and lead their masters to that paradise. Ah, so let's evolve them so we can do something else. So what are you doing here? Well, I did some research, found the holy light like the Chocobo's forest, and we can find more Chocographs. So the way the lagoon works is to the west there you have the deep part of the lagoon. And so we don't have the ocean ability yet, so therefore we cannot get, we cannot dig in that area. We can only dig in a shallow area because we only have access to the shallows at the moment, okay? So there you go. You can only dig in the shallows. So half area means half time and half price, okay? All right, so I'm going to do one run of this without the speed. Um, you know, with the uh, cheating speed method. And then I'll do one with the, the speeding cheat method. And then I'll make a cut, and then I'll come back to when we actually have caught all the choco grass. All right, so here we go. See, it's only 30 gil a game. Yay. So you're going to remember... Okay, so you have all those H's, means we're almost there, folks. There we go, we get Gitchell Greens.
Alright, this is the way it's the game is intended to be played at this slow speed here. Oh, come on. That's it! Okay, I only got the one Gishel Greens. Now we're going to hit the R1 button in the pause menu, make high speed mode. We're going to do this again. Remember, we already have a level 99 Chocobo. Come on, there you go. I don't even know what we got. Find out later, folks. Okay, good. Okay, oh, we got a chocograph, I think. Oh, it's out here. This is much better. Come on. And if you top out at four of them, then he'll quit like on the other one. He topped out at eight. We got our chocograph, yay. Matter of fact, I'm gonna do one more so I can show you what happens when you um, top out at four. So, get a potion. Come on. Off screen, I was doing this so much better. Okay. Chocograph Peaks. So, he'll cut us off. He says we'll go out of business. So I'll just give you a special bonus if you quit now. So you get 2 points, 2 points, 12 points, 45, and a plus 112 gives you 173. Alright. I will um, quit whenever, uh, I mean, I'll come back when we get all the Chocographs. Alright, be right back, folks. All right, folks, um, that didn't take very long at all. Uh, maybe about 10, 15 minutes with the high speed on. I mean, that was quick. And I don't need to grind for points because I did that much earlier in the game. You have the same prizes, so. Oh, uh, so why don't you go to the forest or use the chocograph and do some treasure hunting? So we can go back to the forest and we'll do that in our next episode. But no, we're not ending this one quite yet, folks. Because we got quite a bit of chocographs. So the first one we are going to look for is the Faraway Lagoon. And before we can do that, we have to go all the way Back to our ship. I can't just go to the shortcuts either. Go all the way around. So, yeah, I'm going to show you the path back. Because it could be a little menacing and I don't like it. Um, oops, I didn't mean to do that change my perspective a little bit all right so we have to get back on our boat and um, see if I could oh yeah whoops I didn't mean to do that folks Ooh, we talked to blank yes I know where we're going thank you I started okay Okay, so, um, right over here, we have another Q's Marsh. We can make a little detour. Make a little detour here and see if we can make it to the Q's Marsh without running into any enemies. Enemies around here are very tough. Well, this one isn't so bad. I did encounter this off screen. Got a tent right off the bat. And let's 
I don't know how much HP this thing has. Really don't know how much HP this thing has. One more attack from him? I know three attacks from him killed him off last time, and I don't want to do that. Or not. Crap. Hopefully, uh, we'll give him another go. But we do get a whole bunch of, um... Abilities learned, yay. We can do that while we get in the Q's Marsh. Yeah. He's learned all that. Um... You know what? Let's do double duty here. So we learn that one real fast. Let's give him a demon's mail because he hasn't learned anything from it yet. Almost done. Can't learn anything there, unfortunately. Okay. Oh wait, um, the other one was this guy. Still learning. Or he can't learn anything, unfortunately. All right. So we're going to go to a new marsh. And remember, leave one male and one fem female behind. Yes, you can catch frogs. Let's go. Oh, man. These frogs are easier to catch in this one, I find, because more of them run on land. Got two females. And we get a visit from Quail. And he's going to give us the Bistro Fork. Yay. It's an upgraded weapon for Fabinho. So the one here on the left is a male. Let it go. We have two of them here on the right. So we're going to go ahead and keep it. We're going to go ahead and keep that one. So you have that male to the left. Okay, so I think the ones on the left are male and female. And then we're going to get this one here on the right. I think. Alright, I believe we did it, folks. That was pretty quick. Yes, we had enough. I... No, 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 no. Frogs are safe for now. Make some babies so I can catch more of you. I done catching. Yay. Alright, so that was a little detour. Hopefully I run into another one of those Adam and Toys's. If not, then oh well. Wait. Oh, we have another new enemy. I have not fought this one on screen. Get a phoenix down for our troubles. See, I don't know how much HP this thing has. Ink? Uh-oh. That's fine. Six legs, okay. Oh, got rid of some, um, whatever's listening. 
Let's see if we can eat it after second attack here. Hey, 10, 20, so we got 20, 50. Okay, let's see if we get another shot from not him. We don't know how much it's going to cost here. Um, let's get an attack from, uh oh. Not too bad. Let's get an attack from her. Let's see if we can eat it. So, yeah, that's about half. Okay. Steal again. Uh oh. He's dead. He's the one we need alive, too. Elixir Fabinho. That's fine. Let's eat. I don't know if this this is worth it, folks. Um, I didn't fight this thing off screen. Nope, we're getting, getting another attack. I don't know how much HP this thing has. If we had Garnet in our party, okay, taste bad. Well, that was not worth it, folks. do get some new abilities level learn and um, Hendo led gets up to level 29 nice so what does that do for us Can't learn anything else almost done with that oh let's get that bistro fork on look at that attack power Yeah. All right, let's get back on that boat and continue on our journey. That was just a uh, that was just a little diversion. So what we want to do is, in order to find, remember we're on the faraway lagoon. I believe that's what it is. Oops, wrong thing. Sorry, folks. Yes, I know where we're going. Sorry. Okay, where's our uh, footprints? Footprints are on here somewhere. Crap. Okay, good. I don't want to run into anything. Um, more greens. Yeah, remember, is on the uh, Farway Lagoon, like I said. Crap. No. So, the Farway Lagoon. I'm trying to remember where all these chocographs are. You just keep going straight up north. And we're going to be going a ways, folks. Go around this whole thing. And I love the, the ukulele chocobo music. It's great. And we're going to keep going. And see that big bend here? We're going to go around the big bend. And we have to aim for the second inlet. 
And there we go. The reason why I sold all my potions was because we get 37 of them right here. Six magic tags, one shield armor, one Gaia gear. Nice. All right, now we got to go back to our boat. The next one we are going to do is the cold field. And that one's not too bad, actually, but it's a long boat ride. Come on. Let's go. Okay, here we go. It's a little frustrating doing this, but... We'll get it eventually, folks. So yeah, back the way we came. We're gonna get in our handy dandy boat. Not handy dandy notebook, but boat. There we go. Now, now this continent here is called the Forgotten Continent. Um, and then we're going to go to an icy area. Oops, let me go around this way. It's easier to... I don't want to get trapped inside there. So we're just going to go around. The it might be faster. Uh, see, and then I don't take my own advice, folks. Stay on the outside. Okay, there we go. We're going to the right tra trajectory. So now let's... So, you'll see... Okay, hold on. We're not there yet. Okay. I did this so much easier in my test run. Okay, that is... See, there's a town over there that we can't... Well, we'll get there later in the story. I'm not going to mention the name of it. There's some chocobo tracks. Let's make for them. No random enemies. Good. Because I ran into some, and I had to run away from that battle last time. All right. Cold field is really quick and easy. It's just right here on the edge somewhere. There we go, third pack. And we get... Five Echo Screens, seven High Potions, see why I'm selling all my stuff, and a theater ship card to boot, yay. And for this next treasure, we can just stay on here. Ah, uh, what are we grabbing? Let's see if I can remember. Yeah, it's the Forgotten Lagoon. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. And you're just going to go on this side of the ice. This one's not that bad. Then you reach the landmass and make a left. Feels like you're going into a neighborhood for the first time. And then right in this little inlet here. I, f I one time this last time. Don't. Took me five this time around. Get eight Gishal Greens, five Ethers, seven High Potions, one Dragon's Claws. Get some really, really nice equipment here. All right. And back the way we came. Yes, I'm showing all this traveling because stuff's not easy to find if you don't know where you're going. Yes, I don't want to run into any of those monsters if I don't have to. Next, we're going to head as if we're going to the Black Mage Village to advance the plot. But we don't want to go south. We want to go east, southeast. Here we go. And thank the Lord there's no random encounters in the ocean. Yay! Now we run into the 
this area here. And we're gonna... Yeah, we're gonna be coming back to this island later, folks. If you want to head to this area on the mini-map here, where you see... Now we're on the um, outer continent again. The treasure is actually gonna... Oh! Speaking of which, I better... Gosh darn it. Hey, when I do that, folks... Treasure is actually gonna be right in this inlet here. But we have to travel there first. We have to head for this beach right up ahead. And these chocobo tracks. Yay. And now let's get out the, um, I believe this is the abandoned lagoon. Alright, so let's ride the, hug the coast, so we get to that little inlet I showed you a little bit ago. And here's the inlet, and one shot! Yay! And six softs, four eaters, one feather boot, so we get an extra feather boots, yay. All right, we'll head, head back to our ship. And once we're heading back to our ship, we will... Now we have to head um, towards... Um, the Miss Continent again. That's a very really short boat ride. We gotta hug the coast a little bit. See if I know where I'm going. And, um, yeah, this is the way I went last time. We're going to go around the Miss Continent. I don't know if I'm going the right, 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 right way. But we're just going to go around the Miss Continent. As there we are by the Q's Marsh. There's also some chocobo footprints right by the Q's Marsh. So, as I was saying, we're gonna head for the Q's Marsh. And um, we're gonna go catch some more frogs. I don't mind showing this to you because you haven't, I don't think I've shown this off yet. We have some baby frogs. So I didn't let them fully mature yet. So leave the two adults and catch all the rest. Well, we can't catch the tadpoles, unfortunately, because they can't make it to shore. Let's catch all the baby frogs. could catch tadpoles that'd be really sweet it's not gonna happen see tadpoles don't come anywhere near shore I have is that here I thought I could catch one more yeah, because I was up to 40 frogs on my test run here. Yeah, and I think that's all I'm going to get. 
wish I could pick up those tadpoles. Oh well, too bad, so sad, folks. Well, can I get him? Nope. All right. That's it, folks. That wasn't gonna take very long. Now we still need 60 more frogs. They will have one of the hardest boss fights in the entire game. Which I have never gotten that far, folks. And you will get an achievement for it. Anyway, chocobo tracks are dead ahead straight. Alright, no random encounters this time. Yay! Okay. And we are going to want to open up our, our deal. Yeah, the Dawn Lagoon. Gosh darn it. Is it this way? No, no. Got to head toward our, our marker is Chocobo Forest. So we got to go to the Chocobo Forest. And then we're going to just go down the coast here until we see the sky turn orange like when we were by Trino, if you remember. So now you see the sky go, go darker. Now you hit the shore. All right, now, now you get off shore is what I meant. And the treasure is going to be right in between here somewhere. Uh, so you can, I turn the map around so you can see it a little bit better. It's around here somewhere. This one's a little harder to find. But you will find it eventually. Closer to the island. Here, more in the open. There we go, more in the open. Here we go. And we get some strange smoke. Getting sleepy. We get to evolve our chocobo once again, folks. What are we going to be able to do next? It's this guy again, yay. Wanderer, we await your return. Yeah, the fat chocobo. Now you can climb mountains. You are heading towards your homeland. Hurry home. Yay. So, all right, so now that we can access mountains, we can actually go get one of the very first ones we got, the uncultivated land. And that's the last one we're going to get um, in this episode. So let's go back over here, let's climb the mountains. Yay. You see something a little trippy, at least. Yeah, a little trippy. But well, here's Trino. We're gonna go straight down. And somewhere in this muck. Not 100% sure where it is. There it is. You'll eventually find it. And that's gonna be our last chocograph of the episode. Yay! Um, but before we go, let's see where our, where's Dolly at? Yeah, Dolly, 
Oh yeah. I should be able to find Dolly. I can find Trino, which I did just come from the mountains where Trino is. Oh yeah. So I'm having to go through the south gate this time. Just go around it. Yay. Here's Dolly. I'm going to go get my 99 wrists and I'll be right back, folks. Alrighty. Now we'll um, head back for the Chocobo Forest. If I know where that is now. <laughs> okay, well that was the uh, Evil Forest. Okay. Gosh darn it. Yeah, all right. Um, well, yeah, so we gotta go this way. We gotta basically go due south from where we are. Okay, due south. All right. Maybe a little bit that way, even. Oh, great. I remember this. Crap. There's the marsh. Or is that the uncultivated land? Oh, we're back at Dolly. Going in this direction, apparently. There it is. That's yes, right. We gotta go around, and there we go. All right. It's gonna be our next destination, and um, we'll see you next time. What more chunk of grass can we dig up? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX.